Hello, wild child, or should I call you my soul deep warriors? Today I wanna to speak about overwhelm as a new entrepreneur. How do you push through that? If you are watching, you are a new business owner, you already understand what I'm talking about. It's that moment where you feel there's so much information coming at you, so many things that you have to process, tasks that you have to complete, because when you're first starting your own business, it's just you. You rarely have an entire team behind you. If you're able to, kudos to you, but many people can't. I know when I first started out, I didn't. It was me, myself, and I. I was the one doing everything. And to a certain extent, I still am. There becomes a moment where it's just so much going on, you get stagnant and you feel like, where do I even push through? Where do I go from here? When that happens, ask the four questions. What, why, who, and how? What is my purpose? Why am I doing what I am doing? Who am I serving? And how am I serving them? Get yourself back to that basic. Get yourself back to why you started your business in the first place. Work through all of the clutter that can come about when you are starting your business. All the little minor details that you have to take care of. When it becomes too overwhelming, get back to your purpose. Ask yourself the, fam the famous question, what is your why? What is your purpose? Why are you doing it? Who are you doing it for? And how are you serving them? Think about that. Sit there, write it out, and remind yourself of that so that the next time when you feel any sort of pressure, you can say to yourself, you know what though? This is why I'm doing it. I have to remember why I am pushing through, why I want to give this gift that I have. Because when you start your own business, that is essentially what you are doing. You feel so strongly about the gifts that you have to give to people that you want to start it. You have this vision, you have this idea, and you wanna go through and follow it. And that is your gift. That is what we all want in this world, is to share our gift, whatever that may be. It is unique for each person. So you cannot let the minute details of the world around you, of the, everything that goes into going through and starting a business, to stop you from sharing that gift. Go back to the basics when you feel overwhelmed as a new entrepreneur. Ask those questions again. What is my purpose? Why am I doing this? Who am I serving and how am I serving them? The how I'm serving them question is what avenue are you taking? Is it digital products? Is it, um, you know, is it something tangible? Is it a message you have? Are you doing public speaking? What, how are you getting your gift out to the world? What is your purpose? That one is self-explanatory. What are you trying to get out into the world? Why are you doing it? What sparked this desire to give your purpose to the world? Who are you doing it for? Who's your target market? Who do you want to inspire to move forward and spread your gift to other people? And how are you doing it? What avenues are you taking to get that message out? Write those out and whenever you feel overwhelmed, pull that list out and think to yourself, this is it. These are the four reasons, the four ways I'm getting my message out. I'm not gonna let the minute details get me down because they are simply avenues to help these four questions really go forward to where I wanna be. Stay on target. If you believe in this purpose that you're offering, if you believe in this gift that you have to give so passionately, don't let little things stop you from moving forward with it. Don't let overwhelm stop you from really reaching for what you want in your life. There you go, that is my message for you today. Let me know how do you work through your overwhelm in business. Did this help you at all? Leave it in the comments below. Also, don't forget to subscribe so you can be notified when I do my next video, which will be very soon. Stay tuned. Thanks again for joining.